be here because I've spent like 20 years just right up the coast from here. It's been a lot of time here, so it feels really homey. Um, I know a lot of greats have come through here and received this award. Brad Pitt is an actor and film producer from the United States. He's received numerous awards for his acting, including an Academy Award, a British Academy Film Award, and two Golden Globe Awards, as well as a second Academy Award, a second British Academy Film Award, a third Golden Globe Award, and a Primetime Emmy Award as a producer through his production company, Plan B Entertainment. Pitt originally garnered prominence in the road film Thelma and Louise as a cowboy hitchhiker. His first major appearances in films occurred with the dramas A River Runs Through It and Legends of the Fall, as well as the horror picture Interview with the Vampire. He received critical praise for his roles in the crime thriller Seven and the science fiction feature Twelve Monkeys, the latter of which earned him a Golden Globe Award nomination and a Golden Globe Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. Uh, it's been really fun. It's really fun when your number comes up. I mean, I look at it this way, kind of a wheel of fortune, and there's so much good work every year. If you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button, as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. His full name is William Bradley Pitt, but is also known as Brad Pitt. He was born December 18, 1963 in Shawnee, Oklahoma, making him 58 at the time of this production. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall. Pitt has been actively involved with a number of humanitarian causes throughout his career. He's donated generously to the One Campaign, Make It Right Foundation, and Global Humanitarian Aid Fund. Jolie Pitt Foundation, which he co-founded with partner Angelina Jolie. In 2010, Pitt and Jolie donated $1 million to Doctors Without Borders in the wake of the Haiti earthquake. Through the Jolie Pitt Foundation, the couple donated tens of millions of dollars to charity. Through the Make It Right Foundation, he built 150 affordable homes in New Orleans' Ninth Ward in response to Hurricane Katrina. Brad was previously married to actress Jennifer Aniston. They married in 2000 and divorced in 2005. There have always been rumors that they broke up after he began an affair with Mr. and Mrs. Smith co-star Angelina Jolie. After being in a relationship for nearly a decade, Brad and Angelina married in 2014. They divorced in 2019, but officially separated in 2016. Pitt and Jolie have six children, a mix of adopted and conceived. After Jolie gave birth to their daughter Shiloh, the couple sold the North American photo rights to People magazine for $4.1 million and the British rights to Hello for $3.5 million for a total payday of $7.6 million. After giving birth to their twins Knox and Vivian, they again sold the rights to People and Hello for a total of $15 million. That still stands as the record for most expensive celebrity photographs of all time seismic shift of a time. I mean, it went from the hippie love movement to people locking their doors. It was Vietnam. There was such a change in film itself. Pitt was born in Shawnee, Oklahoma to William Alvin Pitt, the proprietor of a trucking company, and Jane Etta, a school counselor. The family soon moved to Springfield, Missouri, where he lived together with his younger siblings, Douglas Mitchell and Julie Neal. Born into a conservative Christian household, he was raised as Southern Baptist and later oscillated between agnosticism and atheism. He later reconciled his belief in spirituality. Pitt has described Springfield as Mark Twain country, Jesse James country, having grown up with a lot of hills, a lot of lakes. Pitt attended Kickapoo High School, where he was a member of the golf, swimming, and tennis teams. He participated in the school's key and forensics clubs, in school debates, and in musicals. Following his graduation from high school, Pitt enrolled at the University of Missouri in 1982, majoring in journalism with a focus on advertising. As graduation approached, Pitt did not feel ready to settle down. He loved films, a portal into different worlds for me, and since films were not made in Missouri, he decided to go where they were made. Two weeks short of completing the coursework for a degree, Pitt left the university and moved to Los Angeles where he took acting lessons and worked odd jobs. He's named Gary Oldman, Sean Penn, and Mickey Rourke as his early acting heroes. 
His first film role was a background part in a film called Hunk. He can also be seen in the background of the 1987 Kevin Costner movie, No Way Out. After various guest appearances and minor roles, Pitt gained notoriety for his supporting role in Thelma and Louise before going on to star in the Action Award-winning 1992 film A River Runs Through It. Pitt received tremendous praise for his performance in the highly successful 1995 crime drama Seven, which grossed $327 million worldwide. Pitt received a Golden Globe Award as well as an Academy Award nomination for his next film, 12 Monkeys. Pitt's dedication to his roles has taken him up the Alps, in the boxing ring, and in the depths of startlingly accurate accents. Other noteworthy Pitt films include Ocean's Eleven, Troy, Babel, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Fight Club, World War Z, Moneyball, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. In November 2001, Pitt co-founded Plan B Entertainment with his wife at the time, Jennifer Aniston. Brad bought Jennifer out of the company upon their divorce. Plan B has produced dozens of successful films, including Troy, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, and The Departed, The Time Traveler's Wife, Eat, Pray, Love, Moneyball, World War Z, Kick-Ass, 12 Years a Slave, and Ad Astra. It depends on what's the story. It's, you know, does it speak to our time? Does it speak to me? Is this something I feel like I have something to offer? And then ultimately, who's telling the story? In 1991, Brad earned just $6,000 for his bit part in Thelma and Louise. Just two years later, he earned $500,000 for California. That's the same as just under a million dollars after adjusting for inflation. Two years after California, he earned a cool $4 million for seven. The following year, he earned his first $10 million paycheck for sleepers. He earned another $10 million for seven years in Tibet. By the late 1990s, his base film salary had increased to $17.5 million, which he earned for Meet Joe Black, Fight Club, Spy Game, and Troy. He earned $20 million for Mr. and Mrs. Smith and has earned $20 million for most starring roles that he's not a producer. He cut his salary in half to $10 million to appear in the Tarantino movies Inglorious Bastards and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. In 2001, Brad accepted a lower base salary of $10 million in exchange for a percentage of back-end receipts when he co-starred in Ocean's Eleven. When it was all said and done, he ended up earning $30 million from the film. As a film producer, Pitt has earned untold additional millions, perhaps more than what he's earned during his career as an actor. Brad Pitt's net worth is estimated to be $300 million. Brad owns an impressive portfolio of real estate that's worth over $100 million. Brad's longtime primary house in LA has been a veritable compound that he's pieced together over the years through multiple transactions. Located in LA's Los Feliz neighborhood, today the property is actually made up of five contiguous parcels over nearly two acres. The property has four homes, including a 6,600-square-foot main house. He bought his first parcel in the compound in 1994. In 2000, he spent $4 million on a beach house in Santa Barbara. In late 2006, around the time he was planning the construction of 150 affordable homes in New Orleans, Pitt spent $3.5 million on a historic mansion in the city's famous French Quarter. Pitt and Joe Lee listed the home for sale in 2015 for $6.5 million, but ultimately took the property off the market after not finding a buyer. In 2008, Pitt and Joe Lee spent a mouthwatering $67 million on a 1,200-acre winery in the south of France called Chateau Miraval. The main house on the property reportedly has 35 rooms, several guest houses, and a recording studio. They actually married at the Chateau in 2014. This property became a major point of contention during their divorce proceedings and reportedly caused the final settlement to drag on for years. 
They did eventually reach a settlement that likely involved an agreement that they would either sell the property down the road or allow the children to be the primary heirs. In 2015, Brad bought a villa on the Spanish island of Mallorca for $3.7 million. Brad Pitt likely has the following vehicles in his garage, a Chevy Tahoe, an Aston Martin Vanquish Carbon Edition, an Audi Q7, a BMW Hydrogen 7, a Chevy Camaro SS, a Lexus LS 460F Sport, a Jeep Cherokee, and a Tesla Model S.